Newton's first law applies to field hockey when the ball is at rest. Also, when she hits the ball and it's in motion, it stays in motion until an outside force stops it, which in this case is friction and gravity. <laughs> Newton's second law applies to field hockey because if the mass of the ball was 5 kilograms and the acceleration was 20 meters per second, then the ball's force would be 100 newtons. Newton's third law applies to field... <laughs> okay, Newton's third law applies to field hockey because if you tap the ball in the air, the force of the ball going up will be opposite and equal to the force of the ball coming down. <laughs> Hi guys! <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Should we get the school bus? Can this be our real one? <laughs> now. In case you're wondering why this was in our first video, it's because I watched it roll out of my garage to right there and it just stopped. Which is Newton's first law of motion. Wow! What a coinky dink. And I just witnessed it happen. That should be bonus points. Awesome. What? All right, bye guys. Bye. Love science class. Woo!